so much you're not gonna get far I have you very very tightly tied up <laughs> I'll, I'll let you go soon I just I, I just want to make sure that uh, you won't freak out immediately well in general Hi. <laughs> you looked very shocked. I know. You're probably thinking, is this a dream? Is this actually real? Am I actually standing in front of you? You know, I think the same for the first two questions about you. I can't believe this is real. That you're actually finally here with me. Are you are you hurt anywhere though? Polly and Vinny told me they were a little bit rough with you. Okay, good. Just making sure, okay. You know, <laughs> I, I can't believe you're actually here. I, I feel like a fan, really. Is this how you always felt whenever we'd meet at the fan meets? <laughs> you look confused. No, you're not dreaming. This is real. See? <laughs> My skin is real. See? I'm touching you right now. You've got soft cheeks, by the way. <laughs> Yeah, I'm real. No, I... I can't untie you just yet. I'm afraid you'll probably run off, you know? We wouldn't want that, would we? <laughs> you know... Seeing you here before me, it's making me think about the first time that we met. Yeah, when you were the first one to tell me that I would be able to make it. You were the one who told me that I had potential. And you're the reason why I kept on going. And pushing and pushing. And pushing. You're the reason. Why I got to where I'm at now. Did you know that? He 
You said you were my first fan, but no. But guess what? I was your fan too. When you first told me that I can become an idol, the sidewalk, God, I can't remember. Where even was I? Ah, yes. See? You remember? By the park. And I was singing. And I was feeling so lost and so hopeless. And I was trying to grasp at nothing. And you spoke those words to me. And I knew that I could make it. And look. <laughs> We're here now. Of course I would remember. You said you were my first fan, no? You were there at my first concert, second one, third one, fourth one, all of those that came afterwards. You thought I didn't... notice you? I can understand that, actually. We can't really... chat with our fans and... It has to be all strictly business and... even in the fan meets. But... I always noticed you. I actually searched for you in the crowd. <laughs> And I didn't really have to look that far, because you're always there, standing right at the front, waving your big old sign, waving at me, cheering me on. <laughs> God. You're the reason I kept going, along with everyone else, but you hold a special place in my heart, and you will forever. <laughs> I... I know about my... about the secret fan page you have about me. Yeah. Of course I would know that. I know everything about you. <laughs> I know about all the pictures. I know that you were always around. I even know about the pictures that you think no one knows about. You know? When you thought that I wasn't aware that no one was around taking pictures, I knew you were there. <laughs> of course I would know. Mm. No, I didn't find it creepy. Because it was you. I'd have enjoyed it. The fact that you kept on taking pictures and that you made sure I was okay. You were always around. Like if. Like if you were my. my little guardian. You even went past Paul and Vinny. That's crazy. <laughs> I love that about you. So sneaky. But... Then... Why did you stop coming? Why did you stop coming... To my concerts? 
he started coming less and less. I... I looked for you. I looked for you amongst the crowd, and... I wouldn't see you. So I had... So I got worried, and... I... I dug a little deeper, and I found out that... You started going to... To other concerts for other idols. <laughs> and you also started other fan pages for them. And fan merch. And you started going to their fan meets. And yet, I wasn't too worried because you would still tweet about me and say how oh, I'm still your number one so I am your number one right? I still am but you know what it doesn't matter because I know that I'm still your number one and you're my number one okay So I, I'm not too worried about that. But, you know, you did have me worried. I, I thought something had happened to you. And I also know that your new job has been keeping you busy and so... I know how hard it must have been to choose between me or the other new idols you started getting into. I get that. I still appreciate everything that you've done. I don't care if you... Well, actually, I do care if you look at other idols. Because... I want you to only look at me. Only me. I want to be your only idol. Is that... Is that possessive of me? I'm kind of embarrassed. I feel like I'm showing you different sides of myself that you probably never knew of. Maybe you did know. I feel like a part of you... I feel like a part of you knew that I was aware of of you always being there is was this your plan to get me jealous is that why you started seeing other idols fanning over them is this why you started coming less to my fan pages and being less around me and started taking less pictures of me and I didn't see l you anywhere. I missed you. Was that your plan? Cause it worked. <laughs> I can't tell what you're thinking. I already showed you that I'm real. You seem confused. Are you enjoying this? Are you happy? Because I'm happy. You're finally looking at me again. Looking at no one but me. And I want to keep it that way. <laughs> I want to keep it this way forever. So, would you only look at me? Do you see where we're at right now? See? This is everything they've given me at the fan merge. 
See, this is the bracelet you made. These are the flowers that you gave me. Although, they're... They're a little bit... Well, they're... Very withered now, but... These are the teddy bears you gave me. <laughs> the little cat ears. <laughs> I love these. I could put them on for you. I can do anything you want. Oh, and look here. I have all your letters that you gave me. <laughs> I... I would read them. And I still do. I read them every night. Every single one of your letters, every stroke of the lines that you have written in them, bring a smile to my face. Did you know that? God, you make me so happy. And I know that we're going to be happy in this room. This room is meant for us. I just... And actually, this entire house is made for us. Paul and Vinny, well, they're not going to tell anyone about this, okay? They're my most trusted bodyguards. And they'll keep this a secret for us. So that way, you can only look at me. I handled your job. Told them that you were gonna quit. Sent your two weeks notice for you. I handled your lease at your place. Now you're here with me. And... You won't have to worry about anything else. All you have to do is just look at me. Only at me. That way I know that you're there. That you're gonna be there forever. Yeah? How does it sound? <laughs> I'm so happy. The, I can I can give you your own little private shows. I we can do so much together. <laughs> Who would have thought? Fan and an idol. <laughs> this is my dream come true. I know that it's yours too. No. Well. <laughs> well, I have to go and get ready for my concert. Fortunately, I can't bring you with me because uh, I feel like I need you to get adjusted to this for a bit and we, we should talk more after, and we will, after the concert. But then after that, after, after you're all settled in and you're okay, we'll be doing a lot more things together forever, okay? So... Just sit tight. <laughs> I mean, you're tied up, so you really can't go anywhere. So just hold on a bit, okay? I'll, I'll be back home soon. Our home. <laughs> I just don't even want to do this concert anymore. I just, just want to stay here with you and talk to you. But I know that we'll have more time together in the future, so... <clears throat> Oh, I'll be back, okay? Wish me luck. I'll see you later. to lock up the door tight, okay? I'll be back. If you liked the video, make sure to leave a like.
subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Thank you. Mm -hmm.